Hey everybody, Simon here. In this video, we're going to take a look at which prepaid carrier supports RCS in iOS 18. So I updated my iPhone 15 Pro to iOS 18. Now let's see which prepaid carrier supports RCS. And you're going to see right there, yes, it's iOS 18. And I'm going to scroll down to, let's first go to Tello. And all I do is I just tap on the carrier I'm IMS status and it's only voice and SMS, unfortunately. So Tello does not support RCS. And let's see Boost, because I have Boost Mobile on this iPhone 15 Pro as well. And I tap on IMS status. Nope, no RCS on Boost Mobile at the moment. And if I go under the messages, the settings under the text messaging part and there is no RCS available. So I actually turned off my boost mobile line and I turned on us mobiles, dark star network, which uses AT&T. So let's see if there's RCS enabled. So there's us mobile and I tap on IMS status. And unfortunately on the dark star area, there is no RCS support. So I turned off US mobile and now let's see if visible have RCS support and voice SMS and RCS is supported on visible. If I go in the messages app under text messaging section. Yep. RCS is available. So it is kind of disappointing to see other prepaid carriers aren't ready yet to support RCS, which is unfortunate. Uh, at least I could test it with visible, which I'm going to do right now. So here I am testing out RCS messaging on the left is my iPhone with visible basic. And on my right, I'm using an Android phone. And this time I'm using us mobiles warp network. And for the most part, RCS messaging was working. I was able to send messages, see typing status between two phones as well. I think the only thing that that was a little bit strange was when I send pictures to each other and then react them using emojis uh, on the iPhone, I only see like, you know, a happy smile to this GIF or on the, on the Android side, when I react to whatever the image I got from, I get a laughed at, uh, to this image. So that's the only thing that I noticed between, uh, reacting images using RCS. Uh, I think I did have one hiccup where when I was trying to send an image uh, from the iPhone to the Android device, uh, there was a little bit stalling issue. Uh, like it just, the message just wouldn't go through. So I eventually had to turn on my Wi-Fi, and then I was able to send that picture. So I think that was the only issue that I encountered, but overall so far it's been working. I also tested out sending audio files over RCS and here are the results. Hello, hello, testing, testing. Testing one, two, testing one, two, testing one, two. Testing one, two, testing one, two, testing one, two. So here are the other two carriers that I know that support RCS. So if you're on Life Wireless, which is the Lifeline version of PureTalk, then that supports RCS as well. And recently, US Mobile's Warp Network, which uses the Verizon network, now supports RCS. So these are the results of which prepaid carrier currently supports RCS. But I wanna know what are your thoughts? Please leave a comment below and I'll add to this list as well. Which carrier are you using and does it support RCS? Also, feel free to check out my MVNO review playlist.